Before the video starts, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell to never miss any of my uploads. Enjoy the video! Son, do it. Don't you dare disappoint me again. Father, I know that you and Zeus have bad blood, but I don't think Mario is a bad person. He is the enemy. Get rid of him now. for is getting away. No. I won't do it. Maybe I misheard you. Did you just... I won't do it. He seems... Nice. Nice. His father banished me to the pits of hell for eternity. Does that sound like nice to you? And you banished me to an eternity in that pit. You're cruel, father. Maybe you two aren't so different after all. You belonged in that pit, boy. I never thought something so vile could be my own blood. Well, I'm out now. I was strong enough to escape. Don't be a fool! The only reason you are in the Earth Realm now is because I didn't burn you to a crisp. You should be thanking me. Thanking you? 
couldn't be more excited to get away from you. You may have given me life, but you ruined it as well. Say that again to my face, boy. sent you on this mission. You're going back to the pit. Forever. No, stop, please. No. No. S Sorry? No. Soren. Uh, hey. Okay. Soren? Hey, I didn't mean to just barge in, but I heard you saying no, so I wanted to make sure you were okay. Oh, yeah, I'm okay. Sorry. I think I was having a nightmare or something. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Um, anything I can help with? No, it's, it's okay. Ever since I spoke to the Oracle, I've been having these weird nightmares and flashbacks and I don't know I'm I hoping see. that I'm getting a little bit closer to solving who my parents are well I hope so too um speaking of the oracle that's actually why I stopped by um can I get the eye back possibly oh yeah there you go thank you appreciate that and if you need to talk about something just let me know Okay. Okay. Thank you um, again so much for letting me borrow that. Yeah, yeah, of course. Uh I've I've got to go now. Um oh. but uh okay. I'll I'll talk to you later. Okay? Okay. Uh bye. Bye. Thank you again. I don't like my mind right now Stacking up problems that are so unnecessary Wish that I could slow things down I wanna let go but there's comfort in the panic And I drive myself crazy Thinking everything's about me Yeah, I drive myself crazy Cause I can't escape the gravity I'm holding on why is everything so heavy holding on to so much more than I can carry? I keep dragging around what's bringing me down. If I just let go, I'd be set free. I'm holding on. Why is everything so heavy? You say that I'm paranoid, but I'm pretty sure the world is out to get me. It's not like I made the choice To let my mind stay sorta of messy No, I'm not the center of the universe But you keep spinning around me just the same No, I'm not the center of the universe But you keep spinning around me just the same I'm holding on Why is everything so heavy? Holding on so much more than I can carry I keep dragging around what's bringing me down If I just let go, I'd be set free Holding on Why is everything so heavy? I know I'm not the center of the universe But you keep spinning around me just the same 
know I'm not the center of the universe But you can spin around me just the same And I drive myself crazy Thinking everything's about me I'm holding on Why is everything so heavy? Holding on To so much more than I can carry I keep dragging around what's bringing me down If I just let go and he said Holding on Why is everything so heavy? Why is everything so heavy? Why is everything so heavy? It's okay, Soren. It's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. I hope. I need to find some way to calm myself down. There's so much on my mind right now, I can't even think straight. I need, just need something to distract myself for a while. And I'm thinking, <laughs> what better than maybe some kind of game or something in the recreational hall? Maybe I can find something to do in here. I mean, there's a ton of activities to do at the camp, so this is this is the main area for activities. So maybe I can find a book to read. No, I <laughs> I can't read, so that wouldn't really work. But I guess maybe I could write something. But I forgot no one actually ever taught me how to write either. <sighs> this game looks interesting. The two different colored squares. I wonder how you play that. <sighs> I guess it would be nice to have some people in here to play, you know, something with. But definitely need to try to branch out more. Still don't really have any friends. What are these? Little pieces of paper. Interesting. Maybe I can have someone teach me how to read. I mean, there's so many books in here. I don't know what I'm going to do otherwise. I mean, I don't know how to do any of this stuff. Growing up in a cage, I guess. No one really tells you how to hang out with people, or play games, or read books, or write stories. I mean, what's this? It's like a table with colorful balls on it. I'm assuming that these sticks have something to do with it as well, but... I don't know. And is this some sort of punching bag kind of thing? It's the only thing I can assume. <laughs> Oh, what's in here? Classroom? Oh, people must come in here and <laughs> just learn stuff. I wonder if I can look into any classes going on. Maybe I can learn how to read and write. That'd be cool. Definitely start fitting in a little bit better. What's down here? A staircase? Where does this lead? Huh. Arts and crafts. Interesting. Um, this room's kinda creepy. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and avoid this one. What's this? The media center? <gasps> Whoa! These are those computer things that everyone's been talking so much about. I've never seen a computer before. These are so cool. Wow. Yeah, I'll definitely have to come back at some point and check these out. Hmm, what's down here? Storage room? Oh, but it's blocked off. I wonder what's in there. I probably shouldn't break in. Staff only? Well, 
I mean, definitely not staff, but I also definitely don't see anyone down here that's gonna stop me. Ooh. Hey, it's another one of those tables with the colorful balls on it. Wow. And a whole kitchen? Just to the staff? That's pretty cool. Maybe I'll have to sneak down here more often. Maybe they'll have some better snacks and a better variety of food as well. I don't know. <gasps> a TV! Oh, that's perfect. Let's see what's on. Maybe I can find something to distract me for a while. Welcome to Moku. Here on this beautiful island paradise, we have many luxuries. Come on, let's take a look. Of course, your first stop on our beloved island should be on the beach. Kick off the shoes and get some rest and relaxation on the warm and soft sand. Ooh. When you're done admiring the beautiful ocean views, head on over to the gorgeous forest where we have a wide variety of wildlife. There is always something new to see there. Blah, 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 blah. We all know you're here for the lava jumping and surfing. Oh, wow. Austin, you need to have a calm voice to attract tourists where I land. Oh, right, right. Channel my inner Bob Ross. It wouldn't be home without a beautiful volcano to provide you with food, free entertainment, and a place to talk to your mother. Right. Well, that's not all the beautiful island of Moku has to offer. We are also a very open and diverse group of pantheons. In fact, we had help from this beautiful daughter of Aphrodite. Whoa. I told you guys I wasn't doing this. Come on, this way it'll be fun. Here you can see the beautiful exquisite gardening skills on display. The way the colors flow are guaranteed to distress anyone. That's so pretty. So what's not to love? Come on down to Moku. Enjoy the breathtaking views, the serene sounds of the ocean, and the glistening lights coming straight from Pele herself. Ooh, wow. We even have some hotel rooms for you and your families. The cheapest and most clean. There's nothing to hate. Stay for a day or a week. Call 1 800 25. Forget the call. Just come on down. This is lame. This is amazing is what she meant. Moku, huh? How do I get there? <laughs> After you. just for the sake of forgetting about them. Yeah, we're like, we have to tell her we pranked her, because if she just walks in and sees them, the whole I, know. I was like, what if she doesn't see the side of Crack Race, and then someone <laughs> is <just> like... <laughs> Austin goes back in and hangs <laughs> another skeleton. <laughs> I literally turn around and she goes... <laughs> I was like... <laughs> Can we take a selfie with it? Let me take a selfie. Hello, mysterious figure. <laughs> I love being an adult. I tried to soul stone it, but then am I not holding? No, oh, there we go. Oh, oh, it was. Uh... <laughs> There's a person in my pocket. <laughs> Stop. <laughs>